Hey, this is Josh Gwynn back with another lecture on how to build a fully mobile responsive website for your business or for a client in less than an hour. Uh, in this section of the course, I'm going to show you how to add a, um, a YouTube video. So if you or your client have a video that promotes your business, these look really, really good on these Strikingly websites, and I'm going to show you how to do that. Uh, but first, when you log back into your Strikingly dashboard, this is what you see when you log in. In order to get started editing your site again, go to the site that you are wanting to edit, which in this case for me is this one right here, and click Edit, and it'll bring you into the editor. Now once you're there, uh, you'll see the site that we've been editing. It's about to come up here right now. Alright, there we go. So now we have the site we've been, we've been editing. This is the uh, slider. Uh, this is the uh, About section that we added. Scroll down here to see our um, our gallery, our picture gallery. And this is a section I added after uh, our last video and I shouldn't have added that without showing it to you so I'm gonna go ahead and delete that section. So um, if you need to delete a section that's in your your site just click the uh, the X button next to that section and it's gonna remove it. And click OK. So what I'm going to do, uh, if you remember in our last section, we talked about how to, um, you know, how this this area kind of blends into the our work section. So I wanted a, a section in between here that kind of, um, you know, breaks these sections up. And so I wanted something that was a, a different, slightly different color background. So what I'm going to do is go over here to add new section, and I'm going to scroll down. And this you may you may need to just uh, play with this a little bit to see where these sections go. It's very easy to drag and drop sections, um, but see how you like the layout of it. So it, it's real easy to make these changes, but um, what I'm going to do in this case is I'm going to pull in um, a uh, call to action. And this is a, this is a large media block with a, a call to action. So I'm going to go ahead and click that, and it will add that section that you just saw. So this is a call to action section and you can see the background of this section is kind of a little bit gray so it'll be good to break up the why us section from the gallery so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a video and the video that I'm gonna add is this uh, is this transformer uh, promotional video that I have for my company um, I'll let a little bit of it play Alright, so you kind of get the idea of the video. It's a promotional video for my company. I'm going to go ahead and add that in. And um, so what you do is you just copy the link, uh, the URL for the YouTube video. So I'm going to copy that and then I'm going to go in here and click edit over this uh, large area. Click replace. Actually what you want to do for video, image is selected right here. So you want to select video and then it's going to ask you to enter the uh, video URL so you can use YouTube, Vimeo, um, whatever video URL you want to use so since I have a YouTube video I'm going to go ahead and enter that and click save and it will load this video into that space alright so there's that video and it will play right in this space and um, I'm going to change this text of this area to um, actually I'll tell you what since I just want the video here um, I'm going to remove this this text box and I'll show you how to do that so um, in order to remove a text box just cl clip empty and then save and then you can empty this one too if you wanted to and click save and so then I'm going to just use this button and um, I'm going to get this button to link to uh, the section that is going to be my uh, about us section. So um, actually what we'll do is we'll link this to the our work section. But first what I want to show you is how to move these sections to where they kind of work together and break each other up. So um, what we're going to do first of all is change the name of this action section which is this where the video is. I'm going to go ahead and change that to something else. So we'll call this HD video. In the, so when you go down to HD video it'll take you to this section of the site 
and because this background is gray and I want to use it to break these two sections up I'm going to just drag the HD video section below the about us section so that section is now going to appear in between the about us section and the our work section All right so now when you see you you're at the top you go to the why us section or the about us section and then you come down and you have that large video block that showcases some of the uh, specific uh, product offering that we have and then that you scroll down further and you go into the our work section and this gray background kind of breaks up the two white blocks so I think that looks really good so anyway what I want to do with this button is I want this button to link them down to the our work section so once they see if a customer watches this video I want the button to link them down to where they move into the next section of the um, of the website so in order to do that you click edit and um, what you can do is uh, under the link URL you could link this to an external site if you wanted it to go away from your website which I don't recommend uh, or link to a section within your website now this is um, once you get this it's going to be it's really easy to understand but as you can see right now we have four sections of our website we have the first section which is the slider second section is the about us third is this video block we just created and then fourth is the uh, the gallery that we've already created so I want it to link to section number four and to do that all you do is type number four here and click save and now this will link down to this section when somebody clicks on it and I want to edit the text of that block so I'm going to come in and say um, see our work we'll see how that looks alright so see our work now will link them down to this section and, and it creates kind of a continuity on your website and um, just to save all these changes click save and keep editing and we're going to preview this so we'll see how it looks on a live website. All right, so we got the top section um, with our slider, which still um, looks pretty good. I'm still happy with that. Scroll down to the About Us section, and it talks about our company. Next section is that HD video section and you can see from here that it'll play that video within we'll pause that so it'll play that video within that section and then if you hit if the client hit the button it would bring them down to the our work section which is where we have our gallery so that's looking good so far so in the next section of the course I'm going to show you how to add another section with the contact form so check out the next section and thanks for watching